To the naked eye, this snowy valley doesn't look like much, but to me, it's my new home. And why is it so good? Well, because of the big dip, it enables me to hide my base underground and nobody's gonna suspect it because above ground, it's gonna look really pathetic. And it wouldn't be one of my stories if there wasn't a clan to hide from and just around the corner was this group. Okay, you stay there. We raid your two by two. Bye -bye. They raided the two by two. They're gonna raid the two by two. He's gonna raid the two by two. And as always, this story begins as a fresh spawn looking for that eco raid to get a jump start on the wipe. It doesn't take me long to find one. Easter egg hunt. Where are my eggs? Basket. Or an arrow. And the Easter egg hunt led me to this raid base and raided compound. Probably shouldn't run deeper into the. Uh the snow but i'm intrigued as to this raid base if it might have loot in it what do we think chat do you think this will still have loot in it or do you think they moved it all out it's not decaying so i farmed up the necessary resources which really isn't much and decided to start the eco raid oh god he's actually doing it right guys you got 10 minutes go get yourself a coffee that's just for those guys that watched it live which by the way thank you for for you guys watching at home on youtube ceiling was down to 10 health i'd need to get one more spear i dropped all my loot i did everything i could to make myself friendly but these guys still kill me now note their names Why did he check my body? I just spawned. As you can tell, I found that a little frustrating. Those guys killed me. I was naked. I had a hatchet. I tried to survive. I've now got to make my way all the way back. So Arla, I remember you. But little did I know that they will be far more integral to the story than I knew right now. Oh my God. And this is how Rush just turns on you. I am once, not even once to be on like three hits from getting in. Two guys run past me. I'm trying to show them I'm surrendering. They still shoot me. I came back and broke through. Fortunately for me, they had no idea what I was doing in the area. Okay. The moment we've all been waiting for. Will there be loot? Will there be loot? Oh, this, this is promising. Let's start with the top box. Okay, we've got some trousers and a solar panel. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Two ladders, thousand wood, cloth. Come on! Yes, this was worth. This was worth already. This this was worth. What do I do to secure? I was farming. I actually fucked that. There's two of them out there. AK. He had AK. Oh, that would have been so good. By the time I get back, there's a huge fight going on. Lol. They own that base. They own the base. Mm. Well, that deteriorated really quick. I mean, like, I had such a great start. And just like that, I'd lost my main guns. But it's not the end of the world. I still have this base and a few items. Let's get make some resources so I can actually make a quick base. Because um, this isn't secure. Um, um, this is not good. Who are the people that just killed me? Well, that remains to be seen. And that is quite an interesting story. Oh. <gasps>
This was Arla and Shanika, the guys that killed me when I was breaking through into the base. They must have been caught up in the fight as well. Maybe I'll claim the ice lake. I'll claim the ice lake. Misha, this was a name I hadn't seen before. Should have known. Should have known. Enemy acquired. I don't care. I want to know where they live. I don't think they're a clan. I do not think they're a clan. Why don't I think they're a clan? Well, that's because they were running around with crossbows earlier and then a double barrel shotgun. And I'm assuming Misha killed me and then Arla went into the base to dork at me. They could be associated. They might not be. They got it. All right, find where they live now. Mission, find where they live. They didn't lose a lot. Ladders are annoying. I can't believe no one's built this ice lake. That's quite interesting. I had to leave the snow because the cold would kill me, but my plan for now was to live on the ice lake. It was really close to sewer branch, so I could get a lot of scrap that way. And as I left the snow, I came across this clan for the first time. The moment I shine my torch, you shoot at me. It has to be the clan, right? It can't be anyone else. As it was night, I decided just to farm the road. Catch it. I have to wait to daytime, guys, before I can go back into the snow. I don't like living in the snow, but I think that's probably the best place to live. And I want to find those guys. Oh, I think this is them. Misha and Arla. Is it Misha and Arla? Arla. Again. We need to find where they live, guys. I don't know how to track them. Why are they running so prim? I don't think it's a clan. They live in this vicinity. As day rise... As the sun rises, I decide to go check out the clan base to see if I see any names I recognize because after all, if Arla is part of this clan, I don't want to take on this bigger target today. I wasn't in the mood. Of course, toxic, toxic. Okay, we'll find them. Nettie and Arla, they were fighting. So we know that, that Arla's not part of the clan because they were fighting. I think that's a fair assumption. That clan, we can maybe, we could probably grub for loot. I'm pretty sure. But they're not the enemies. They, they, might, they might just be our source of loot. Right, let's get started. I'm happy. Let's get started. I was content with the wipe so far. I'd found an enemy which I thought was a duo, maybe trio. And there was a clan nearby that I could hopefully just grub for loot and get some guns from. However, why did I need to leave this ice lake? Why would I need to build my Snow Valley bunker base? Well, this remains to be seen and it's still to come. Okay, we have a base. Done. We are secure. Over the next hour or so, I spent the time grinding, farming resources, and getting blueprints. Oh my god, there's a car. Is what's going to win? Paddle or hatchet? Fuck it. Hatchet. Come back, bitch! And whilst I was out farming, I came across Rebecca, who is also important to this story. Hey, Rebecca. And Rebecca lives just here, on the edge of the snow between me and the clan. In this turrets. And as I said, the clan was going to be my source of loot, so periodically I'd go check on them, and I found them in a situation where they were out, so I thought I'd eco raid the airlock to see if I could get in. Absolutely outrageous play what I'm doing right now. Misha, listen, Misha, oh my god, Misha's part of the clan, oh my god, Misha's part of the clan, Misha is part of the clan, we found them, oh, I didn't want to be targeting a clan, it's not fair on the clan, so with a big mission at hand, I decided to go full grind mode, doing lots of sewer branch runs to get enough scrap to research plenty of items to take on the clan with, I just needed to wait for my opportune moment. Another meal crate? Wow. I struck gold on that one. Fuck, 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 fuck. That was Elmira, and he just got away with a lot of loot. Not the end of the world, but it did frustrate me. And another name for you to note, but don't worry, guys. It's the last name for you to remember. Yep, hello, test, test, test. Yeah, yeah it's better. Right, well, unfortunately, we have a huge enemy. I saw. With such a large mission at hand, I decided to invite friend and fellow streamer Yakov, and he was going to help me take on this clan. We got five satchels crafted. All right, that's awesome. What are you, what are you thinking of raiding? Um, well, there's two choices. We could smash and grab the clan. They have two beds in the gatehouse with two boxes above. I feel like that's counter beds. 
Or we could raid... Two by one. The more... Yeah, the yeah. more guaranteed loot. The area we lived in was full of nodes. And it was very easy for us to get loot. So we decided to go raid a base in the area, which was a two by one. And it looked like potentially a farm base. We'll probably take that in case it's close just... range. Guy here, guy here, go in, go in. Ah, I fat, fat fingered it. Hit him three times. Let's go in. That's such bad timing. He downed. He's on the rock still. Yeah, I'm down. Dead. Honey. You better not get out, bro, or you're getting raided. No, no, no. Oh, no. I'm doing it. I'm down outside. We might get raided. <laughs> you think it's a clan? He's Surely not. Clan, isn't he? I don't know. I, I think it is. He's Filipino. Filipino yeah. accent. What we'll do is we can transfer the loot into the base we raid now. All right, you, I'll just take crossbow. You take Revy. Let's get this done before game over. He's farming. He's on full farm. They wouldn't raid us now, but they'll definitely get us later. I reckon they could hit us now. With no other bases in the area, this little base tucked away on the mountainside looked like it could be juiced. doors and stuff yeah 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 i suspect oh we shit here we're in base ship oh, it's a farm base leave the stuff in here i suggest we move some stuff into here no he's got a gun what does he he's got, D he's got a db or some something Is that a pump? Alright. Slow. Got him. Oh, I think we might be losing this base. Yeah, literally just beelining it. They've just put more bags down. Holy shit. Same guy. Silence down. MLG. Okay, you stay there. Different we raid your hey, 2x2. Okay. They're raiding the 2x2. Two two. They're going to raid the 2x2. Two two. He's going to raid the 2x2. Really? Seal. I'm yeah. on back timer. I'm on, one, I'm on three minute bag timer. <laughs> I spawned. Just metal, metal, metal the base if you yeah, can. Yeah, yeah. A threat by a clan of that size is something I don't take lightly, and we were rich. We secured as quickly as possible, but it would not be hard for them to raid us. Just a shit real quick. <laughs> not too, I'm not even too sure what we did to piss them off. I had to go soon, so I thought the best thing that we could do is move our loot into a secret hidden base somewhere else. I know which bags he plays, so I'm gonna go chop them now. Do you, do you have outside bags? Uh, yeah. We then moved all our loot over just in case they offline raided us. Right, that's the loot transferred. Hopefully we don't get raided. Isolate bag, I think is gone. Let's have a look. No, oh, it's there, still here, still here. They threatened us, but they didn't raid us. Interesting. And there's been some new bases progressing overnight. Uh, let's check out the clan. I think the attack might come today, so I need to make sure I live out that base. Today was the day that we're going to make some headway on our Snow Valley Bunker base. I don't like living out two bases, so I prefer to live in one and I like the idea of having a secret underground bunker. But let's get the furnaces going. Let's get, get the home fires burning. And as you can see, our other base wasn't raided either. So today was going to be a good day. Or well, so I hoped. Um, what else should I buy, guys? For 30, 15... Thing is, I'm just better off just buying the SARS, right? For 10. There you go. Bought loads of SARS. Did you just see the glitch in the system there? Who just saw that glitch in the system? Basically, my drone was about to arrive with the one are done. I used the same machine. I pressed one buy, one buy, one buy to buy three more dro to buy three more SARS. But three drones didn't go flying off. It just, when it depoted, it depoted everything on my whole order. Getting guns would be our next step towards success, and getting it researched was my next action. All right, SAR. 
It's learned. That's good. That's huge. This is the valley that I would like to live in. This valley is epic. Yeah? You like it? I like it. Hearing a lot of explosions close by, I went to check them out. Is it that base there? As a clan just level that base. Okay, note to self. Clan will MLRS you first. This clan, and if you haven't already figured out, they're from the Philippines, level everyone in this area. And for some reason, we didn't get raided last night, but the base that popped up overnight did. Maybe they thought that we moved there. And I have perhaps. I'm guessing that's a no. Gary. As you can see, I'm still roaming with a revolver. That's because we haven't got round to crafting a tier two workbench yet. We were hoping last night a raid would have got us that, but it didn't. So today the focus is moving into this new base and of course getting tier two and if not tier three. Would you mind marking the new base with a different color? Just yeah. All right, well, we're looking pretty good with all the loot consolidated. All right, I'll go get some stone. Jackoff went to get stone and I went to get wood. And on my little wood farm is when I came across this space with, for some reason, an unfinished compound wall. And guess who lived there? Uh, E13. Elmira. I had a score to settle with him from day one. Before we could mess with him or the clan, we needed to make sure that we were in slightly a defendable state when it came to a raid. So it meant upgrading, smelting, and so on and so forth. And this is what the base is beginning to look like. And right now we're upstairs. With the tier two now being placed, I could finally craft the SARS, which I'd gone to buy earlier. Mr. Spot. How's that look? <laughs> nice? Beautiful. Hitting the clan for nine satchels. Um, nervous about the two meds. <laughs> yeah. Good. Right here on the right. Farmer, I think. Yes, yeah, see him. He's trying to be sneaky. Oh my god, we actually need that. It's Rebecca! I know I know the I know I know this guy. Now, Rebecca never actually wrongs us, but Rebecca is still part of this story, and you'll see soon enough. That was actually a really worthwhile kill. <laughs> yeah. And finally, things are going our way. We decided to go and raid the clan's gatehouse, hoping for better loot. As we could see, there was an open door in there with a locker. Maybe we could get an AK. Ready? Hold on. <gasps> There's a guy AFK in the other one. There's a guy, like, literally AFK. No locker open though. Margarita. In and out. Actually, I'm going to go hug that door in case okay. he comes out of there because that's where he'll come. Oh, they're taking forever already. They're, they're reacting, 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 okay. reacting, reacting. Yeah. He's coming in the door. This is good. He's opened the door. He's shut the locker, bro. Come on, Sasha, Sasha, please. They shot him. He's, he's real lit. I'm jumping in. Yeah. Yeah, four shot turrets. Hit him hard. I'm 
did the faulty you. turret. You got to. I'm dead. What? Just like that, it was over. But as you can see, the boxes were pretty empty anyway, so we wouldn't have got much profit. But hey, we tested them out. Let's see how they respond. Cabling's fine. What do you mean? We would need to become as efficient as possible to take down this clan. So automating the furnaces so that they kept smelting on their own is the most efficient way to do things. And I always love to do this. Have you ever tried it? Let me know in the comments. You want me to um, upgrade the ceilings to metal? Hmm. They've got this big splash thing on the side. That can... Like the side that they are exits on. That's yeah. probably the real problem. Yeah. I think that just fall rocket. They'd, get every, they'd literally get everything. Like, all along where the furnaces are. Yeah, yeah, those ones. And you'd need to go downstairs and do the... The four there as well, I think. Where? This? Yeah. That's, that's so. honeycomb. Would you know there's a base underneath here if you didn't know already? Even the base owner, Yakov, didn't realize that was honeycomb. But today was all about efficiency, so we started to progress through monuments to get red key cards and better loot. Anything good you get? Uh, I've got a rifle body and three tech trash. Oh my god, I really want a piece of that. Should we have a look? Should we peek? I think, um, can we steer? Check this scrap and we'll stash it if you got cloth. No, you got cloth? I don't. I thought you might have had some. Uh, I've got a bag in here. I can just throw it on the floor. Oh shit, stop, stop. That's a massive fight. That's the clown. They're all together, are they? Yeah. He's over here. He's over here on our right. He's, he's yeah. easy. There's one more yes. on the left. Oh one my more God. on the left. I don't know if he's down. He's in the bush. Yeah, 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 yeah. I whiffed so hard on that guy. Yeah. Can't see him. I domed him. You got him? No, he's not dead though. I headshot him. Just watch out for those he's other guys. The I'm going to go try and loot that other. Killed him. Nice, okay. That clan's gonna push us, surely. Petition to refer Yakov as a budget saw. Uh, peti oh petition God. granted. We suspected that that was a Filipino clan and that they were out looking for our base location. This isn't good. But they had ventured quite far from their base. We were living right under their noses. Do you wanna go fight that? Do you wanna go fight that? Now we've got extra guns. Yeah, yeah. They're, they're fighting over the cave base. Full metal. Look at this. Look at this. Dude, they literally. Sh Killed one that's got the boom. No way. Cover me. One's just coming just, back. Hang yeah, on. Yeah, pin them, pin them, pin them if you can. I'm trying to pin them. I'm trying, 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 trying. He's got the boom. I'm dead. What? How's that guy not dead? The clan was on the hunt for us, raiding every base in their neighborhood. We couldn't get close to them to make a play, so we waited to nightfall and put on some night vision goggles. I think one just died to a shotgun trap. Killed one. Full inventory. Yep, awesome. Oh, I'm instant dead. <laughs> it's a key shot, believe it or not. They absolutely just destroyed me. I wonder the flashlight reaches that far down the hill. The clan raided the first base and then they turned to the next base and that was Rebecca's. And I can't help but feel sorry for Rebecca because Rebecca got caught in the crossfire between me and their clan. I hadn't really done too much to the clan, but definitely they wanted to get rid of me. Oh, Rebecca's dead body. Poor Rebecca. It's our fault Rebecca got raided. Recording. We're live. All right, we got ladder. The world is now our oyster. We're gonna jump into this space and get through that window that's open. Keep going. All right, this is the spot. Oh my god, it's open, chat. It's open. Chat, it's open. <gasps> no fucking shot, it's open.
I don't, I don't think this is like legitimate. Get in! Give it to the man whose head's buried in the ground! Yakov's recording is a bit scuffed because he's not recording game sounds, but he heard a scrap helicopter get shot down, so he goes to check it out. To say he was productive while I was gone is an understatement. He got rocket launcher, explosives, AK, everything we needed to take down the clan. And I know some of you go, oh, it's scripted. Well, this is why the heli got shot down. Are the raiders still here? No, it's, it's the base owners and they're just completely bricked. The Filipino clan got wiped out and they got completely foundation wiped. Who by? I don't know, but check this out. This is some of the best content I've got. Incoming heli. That must be raiders, right? Careful, careful. It's me, it's They're me, transferring it's me. loot from there. It's me. Kill everyone, kill everyone. Oh, uh, one of the homemen is there. It's me, bro. It's me. us, not us. Not us, not us. Why they, what, why they, why they say... I've got two rows of charcoal on me. That's worth taking home. Mate, they have been, that's a lot of rockets. They got full wiped. I missed it all. How crazy yeah. is that? Dude, there, there's stuff under the water. There's little like boxes under the water. Like, you know, loot bags? Yeah. Get that shit. Be careful, be careful, be careful. Clear it, clear it. So many grubs inside, clear it. Inside, inside. Clear, clear, clear first. So many grubs, man. He's got people here to help him clear. Clear first, clear first. What? You wanna go with guns? Okay, I'm coming with, I'm coming with the saw. They're saying get the loot. They're saying get the loot. I'm coming, I'm coming, I'm coming. The heli's around the back. Around the back on the... In the water between the farm base. Oh, okay, I'm going to grab the heli and just the heli crash it. No, no, just take it, take it home. I see the heli. Uh, if you want me, I can jump them when they go for the heli. You stay alive. Yeah, just leave the heli. Just leave the heli. I can see it. I can see it. Got HP. The, the, the raid base is still fucking. Go for mini. Go for. Mini. Yeah, I see mini. Go for it. Yeah, go for it. Just take it. Just take it. Do you right? Where yeah, is it? Right, you guys going on it? Wait, wait for it to sit on it. He's dead. Nice, nice. One more, one more, one more, one more. Pilot dead. Get the looting him. Dead. One more, one more, one more, one more, one more. Yeah. At the, at the heli, at the heli, at the heli. They just opened turrets. Oh, what? That's that's fucking off, dude. I'm pinned by the turrets above me. That's crazy. They just opened all the turrets. But they are. Here, what the fuck? He's got a body awesome full of rockets, man. Are you serious? Yeah, I can hear I can hear him saying it. Get back there now. I've got them pinned. There's just one guy left. Good. A weapon there. I can't leave this area because the turrets above me. Dude. Oh, you're fine. No! Alright, I'm gonna bring a gun from base. Fucking. Like, we, the, we can actually yeah, win this. The raiders, man, are fucking shooting me. Alright, I'm standing back this time with the saw. My saw's pretty fucked, but. Hope. 
I'm killing naked running Stay over. I'm, 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 I I've can got see 13 the guy. bullets. 13 bullets is all I got. Okay, that's fine. I got, I got, I got some. I'm gonna kill this guy at the, t at the, at the heli. Just stay alive. What? I'm just alive. I'm just alive. I got three bullets. All I got. Hold on, hold on. Just stay alive. He's absolutely fucked. He's pinned. I'm dead. No. I, I had no bullets to do anything. I couldn't do anything for you. Killed him, killed him, killed, got him, got him! Killed him, killed him, killed, got him, got him! Oh my god! Let's fucking go! Fuck yeah, oh my god. I just saw your inventory. Go on, Yakov. Yes, baby! I'm fucking out of the- Go Dude, to the- go. inventory, look at my inventory! Oh! <laughs> Sam! <laughs> I called it, I called it, I told you. And they were like, the transfer loot, the transfer loot. And I was there's like, more, there's more, there's yeah, more. I'm trying there's to go. More, there's more, there's Raiders more. have got it covered. Oh my god, he exploded with metal. He was stacking. Hey, kill one guy in TC. One guy in TC. They're calling me out. One guy in TC, one guy in TC. <laughs> I've got a round metal all smelted. Three, six, nine, twelve rockets. One, two, three, four, five, twenty-five, twenty-seven hundred um, low grade. One, Dude. two, three, four, five, six, seven hundred HQM. One, two, three, four, five, six thousand metal. Oh my God, Yakov, what did we just do? Naturally, with all this metal, I expanded the base and made a whole shop front area so that our base looked really pathetic up top. It looked like a role player base. Last one. Bang, 10 furnaces. I don't know how fast that goes, but yeah, done. I also sorted the core out to make it more secure and make it our quick spawn area. And then you're probably wondering who's going to be our target now? Well, there's one more character left and that is Elmira, the one that killed me on day one down in Sewer Branch. Oh no, this, this is just... Um... I want to raid this guy. <clears throat> he um he killed me once. <laughs> There's no real story behind this guy, unfortunately. I'm sorry. You want some epic story? There isn't one. Well, we have those rockets to use, and I want to have a raid. So this is the guy that we're gonna raid. And if you're wondering why I'm in a team with so many people, well, you're gonna have to check out my third channel for that. More Sebi. There's so many side stories that happen from this as well, and they'll all go on there. I was trying to build up. I was just minding my own business. I was doing a really good sewer branch run. He came out of nowhere with a sword and killed me and that was like a 500 scrap run i think got it yeah we've got tons of that's one thing we're not short on oh my god it blew it I'm gonna go in the layer. He's panicking for sure. There's a locker here. Oh, if you can, yeah, go for it. Do you have a tool? Any chance? I can, I can make a spear. No. I'm making a spear. Come with me around the corner in a second. I'm on, his, I'm on his. Okay, I'm on his bed. Oh, he's, 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 he was. Nice. He, Get me up, get me up, get me up, get me up. I need your python. I dropped mine down the middle. Okay. Python's on the floor. Breathing. He can get in though. I don't know where he is. I killed him, I killed him, no worry. I, I killed him. Yeah, destroy the locker. Oh, you're Him. Nice. Oh, get, let's get the fuck. Let's get the L9 everything, dude. L9 everything? Yeah, yeah I've got. I want to hold what you bank, okay? You got it? Okay. Come back. 
Okay, take that stuff. I need to go. I think we should we'll, 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 we should swap places in a minute, and then um, yeah, I'm dead. Uh, yeah. He's still, he's still he mean outside. Oh, there's that kit hanging, yeah. Yeah, I'm trying to get to. I can't get to it. Having already secured a lot of loot from him, I came back with just a python to see if I can get more. He's coming out. Massive. Killed him. AK. Yes. Legend. MGL. Come here. He's up there. Hang on. He's dead. He's dead. He's dead. He's dead. No, 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 no. Okay, take these ladders. Wood. Building plan. Sorry, I'm going to heal. That wasn't the main raid. We just wanted to test out to see how he would react. And then we were going to do the main raid. So we went back to craft more rockets. And then we were ready. Dreaming. All right, all right, all right. Cool. Beautiful. Did my shop sell stuff? Yeah, there was a bit of wood in there. I thought you just wanted to use it for chalk. <laughs> there he is. Hello, Elmira. El I know, I know. It sucks that he was offline. We wanted to online him. I was waiting for that, but he had left. Nothing you could do about that, but this is his loot. You good? I just destroyed the ladder and they can't get up, so I can come look. I'm gonna have a look, yeah. No, where that gone? That went through the wall. Wow. C4. Wait, wait, oh, is that? Uh, is it? Two it's C4, okay, yeah. three satchel, 117 X blow. He's loaded, little solo, man. What? what was in that box that went through the wall, man? Thanks so much for watching, guys. Don't forget to subscribe. And if you want to see all the other stories, it's on my third channel, More Sebi. All the links in the description.